Hello, I'm Margaret and I am a voice teacher at the Community Music Center in San Francisco and um, we're going through kind of a rough patch right now but it's important to keep practicing your music and keep creating. It helps with all the stress. Um, so for you today, I'm just providing some vocal warm-ups to hopefully inspire you to sing some more afterwards. It's always important to warm up first. So uh, the first warm up I highly recommend starting with is something that um, helps you go through your whole range while keeping your mouth somewhat closed. And that just creates less pressure for your vocal folds as you warm up so it's a little safer and uh, it helps you use your air really efficiently. So the most common one you might see is called lip trill. It looks like this. So go ahead and try that and if that's a little too hard to coordinate you can also do tongue trill kind of like a rolling of your R if you're a Spanish speaker and if that is also too hard you can also do what I call hum and chew so imagine that you're eating something really yummy. I'm going to imagine that I'm eating um, freshly baked chocolate chip cookies. And you just chew it and hum. Mm -hmm. And you just wanna slide through your whole range like that. So I'm going to actually play some warm-ups on lip trill, tongue trill, or hum and chew, your choice and you can feel free to warm up with me. So we're going to start with something simple, okay? So it just goes like this. Let's try that together. warm-up I like to do is kind of weird uh, but it kind of helps you warm up your talking voice and so it's very also very gentle um, so just imagine uh, sliding through your speaking range on this little gibberish bly oh bly oh bly bly oh bly oh bly like you're having a conversation and we're just going to warm up in that speech area of our range, going down into our chest range. So it'll go like this. Bly, oh, bly, oh, bly. So let's try that together. Bly, oh, bly, oh, bly. Bly, oh, bly, oh, bly. Bly, oh, bly, oh, bly. Some of us talk a little higher and a little bit lower than others, so feel free to do that one any way you like, um, but I'm going to stop there. So the next warm-up is a warm-up that helps uh, warm up your chest voice. And chest voice is the voice we use when we shout at people or when we're very confident or angry. So whichever uh, way you feel, um, you don't have to feel that way, but that's the voice we're going to warm up. So it's again a weird gibberish warm up. Uh, it's glog leg, glog leg, glog leg. And we're just going to repeat that a lot. So it goes like this glog leg, glog leg, glog leg, glog leg, glog leg. 
and you want to make sure that the sound is really resonating in your chest and kind of feels like you're talking really loudly. So for some people it feels weird, for some others they like it a lot. So let's try it together. Glog leg, glog leg, glog leg, glog leg, glog leg. Glog leg, glog leg, glog leg, glog leg, glog leg. Glog leg, glog leg, glog leg, glog leg, glog leg. Glog leg, glog leg, glog leg, glog leg, glog leg. Glog leg, glog leg, glog leg, glog leg, glog leg. Last one. Glog leg, glog leg, glog leg, glog leg, glog leg. Now, for those who are a little bit more experienced, you're welcome to take that higher if you like, um, but I'm just gonna stop there for now. And the next thing we're going to do is probably the weirdest thing you'll see on this video, which is tongue stretches. Now, our tongue is our main articulator when we sing, so we wanna make sure it's nice and stretched out and not tight. If it's tight, it makes it a lot harder to sing and it can also make our jaw get really tight too. So I like to stretch out the tongue. The first stretch we'll do is called North, South, East, West. So it looks like this. And let's do that together three times in a row. So you stick out your tongue. Like that. And then the next stretch is just a gentle stretch that bites down on your tongue so that it stretches out the root of your tongue, which is all the way down here. So you bring your tongue forward and you bite down. And that's it. You might need a mirror for it. Some people do this and that's incorrect. You wanna keep the tip of the tongue on behind the bottom row of teeth and then bring the back of the tongue forward to bite down. Excellent. Okay, so then the next warm up I'd like to do is a warm up that helps warm up your head voice. And you might feel the sound resonating more in your head space, your nose, sinuses, mouth, wherever is fine, and it won't feel as shouty. Instead, it might feel like you're going woohoo, woo, or um, you know, that, that quality of sound. So, we're going to do this on booty, booty, booty. And the warm up goes like this. Booty, 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 booty. So let's try that together. Booty, 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 booty. and exercises that you can do and play with um, but for now your instrument is probably pretty warmed up and ready to sing something so go have fun sing your favorite song and um, you're always welcome to use this video again for simple vocal warm-ups <laughs>